Hi everyone, Scrappy Kathy here with Mixed Media Mayhem. And I apologize, but I jumped right on this uh, early this morning. And while I went to the uh, my first doctor's appointment, I let it upload and um, it just took forever. And so I decided to go watch it a little bit farther than I had gone into it. I kind of check it. Um, before I upload usually. And sure enough, about, oh, I want to say maybe seven minutes in, it started just dragging and going slow. And so my 27-minute video is probably, I don't know, three or four hours. So I'm going to just lead you through what I did for this layout. This is the original that we're all lifting this week. And it's a beautiful one by Melinda Sweetman for uh, Cut to You. And I'm sure this is a cut file, her uh, kind of waffle, waffly looking uh, heart made of, of X's. It's just gorgeous. And it looks like she's done some mixed media kind of through and around and on top and all over it. And there's a, a fair amount of splattering. And she's got a couple photos and some a little bit of a, you know, a cluster in a couple places and then this clustered title. So I did something sort of similar. Uh, I had been looking for a, um, an excuse to pull out my, um, this stencil by um, <clears throat> Scrapping Reflections. And so you can see I taped it down to the paper and um, kind of like so, and onto my mat. And then I got out, uh, I think I started with salvaged patina down at the bottom, and then I went to peacock feathers, and then switched to salty ocean, and then went to tumbled glass. And I then sprayed a little bit of water, and then I went back after I kind of got the look I wanted there with, I, I was looking for some splatters that would blur the lines of, of the outlines of the heart. And I took this, which is a Diane Reevely stencil and laid it over and just lightly brushed some tumbled glass, I believe it was. Uh, all over the inside, just giving it a very, very faint brick pattern. And so I was very happy with that. I then used a Dilutions Shimmer Spray in London Blue and Polish Jade just to splatter everywhere. I doodled around a couple and added an extra little heart for Calvin Ball points today. As I'm filming this, it's the last day of Calvin Ball. I've got a couple photos, one of John with Barrett on John's birthday in uh, 2005, and then a few months later um, down at my aunt's house in Louisiana for 4th of July. And so I put those photos together, stapled them in a couple places, uh, set them over kind of in the same place as the original, and then added a bunch of Calvin Ball points around. I have some uh, Call Me Crafty sequins from uh, Spiegel Mom Scraps and some acrylics from, from my stash. I've got uh, washi tape that's a film strip, um, uh, an acetate Easter egg. I stamped a, an avocado. I've got f a frame. I've got a hexagon that is embossed with uh, the hexagons, it's a like a beehive kind of a pattern. And I have a bee because that's what we call him. And I've given it a title of Don't Worry, Be Happy. And I have a little cut file from um, Redefine Creative. I cut, uh, fussy cut some, uh, the hot air balloon and the a rocket ship and a, a starship and just kind of added all the things around it. Uh, nothing exotic about what went here. I just kind of stuffed things under the photos um, 
And if you've watched me do this before, you know there's no plan to it. I just kind of, whatever I see, I put it on next. And if it works out that I should have put the coffee cup before the washi tape, I take the washi tape off and stick the coffee cup under. It's not, it's not, it's not rocket science and it's not pretty sometimes. But um, I think this is a fun page. It's not my last Calvin Ball page. There are a couple more hours in the day that I have to to get things in. So I'm going to try to do that. And this it's going to be a, a hell of a day today with uh, a couple doctor's appointments and a video that didn't work. But I wanted to come on and at least give you a video kind of showing you how I made this um, this mess that I made. And um, let's see, I think I tallied up my Calvin Ball points at 99, and then there are six publicity points that I always get, one for making a video, and then others for posting around on Instagram and Facebook. So, and in the, the gallery. So anyway, this one's not one of my highest point ones, but I love it. I really, I really, really love it. I have a flare that's a, a B right there and uh, lots and lots of, of fun here. I have a, a fish after a cat got to it. <laughs> so, thanks for watching and I'm sorry I didn't have the full process for you. Bye.